looking for a little-known but essential part of the USA's Army Air Force's efforts in World War II? Try P. O'Connell Pearson's exceptionally documented, contexted, indexed, timelined book entitled Fly Girls, The Daring American Women Pilots Who Helped Win World War II from your Carmel Clay Public Library. Daring? Let's see. Death-defying. Testing repaired airplanes in the air to see if, well, they really were. Not to mention flying in the air as targets, so soldiers on the ground could train to be anti-aircraft gunners using live ammunition. Enduring. Long hours flying thousands of miles covering many military bases all around the nation. Diligence. Being prepared for planes they might be assigned to fly. Different planes, different manuals. Poise. Always. Not knowing how they would be treated from base to base, after all, the stereotypical view was that a woman's place was to devote herself to women's work, not men's work. These pilots were resented by many within the military and without the military. And much, much more. It took 30-plus years before their sacrifices were fully, officially recognized by the United States of America. For the love of their country, True heroes in every sense of the phrase.